All right, hey collective, I'm back on here to come give you guys a general spread for today. Remember the spread that I'm pulling is timeless, it's also general. So I need for you guys to only accept the message that's for you. If it's not, leave it for the next person. Also, if you haven't already, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. If you haven't already, join me so we can grow the energy over here for you guys, all right? So like I said, we're gonna jump into this energy. We're gonna see what it is that spirit is needing for some of you guys to be aware of as of today, all right? So we have the Reclaiming Your Power card. All right, we have the chosen one. So a lot of you guys could definitely be some form of chosen individual. It's something about you reclaiming your power and being unbothered, okay, by something. Someone's giving you the evil eye right now, okay? So for a lot of you guys, I feel like someone definitely has been trying to definitely have you powerless in some form of way. And I feel like whatever it is that they have been doing, you have been unbothered by it. Someone's envious right now. They're watching you. They're mad that something that they have been doing has not been bothering you, okay? And like I said, for a lot of you guys, for the reclaiming your power, this is someone who has been trying to definitely take some form of power away from you, okay? Um, but we have the backfire card, okay? So something definitely backfired. This could be an older earth sign, a Taurus Virgo Capricorn, that definitely has been trying to do something to, like I said, to make you feel powerless in some form of way. Okay, so for a lot of you guys, something definitely could have backfired on an older earth sign. For a lot of you guys, this older earth sign has been creating obstacles for you or trying to. We have the level and up card that flew out here. And look, we have the spiritual inheritance. So for a lot of you guys, you definitely could be a chosen individual. I feel like you were going through some type of spiritual um, upgrade or DNA upgrade. And whoever this older earth sign is, this person has been trying to block you from receiving this spiritual inheritance. Okay. It's something about this person did not want you to level up spiritually, okay? Um, we have the paid off card that flew out here. So for a lot of you guys, this older earth sign could have been paid off to do some type of spell work. Or um, for a lot of you guys, this older earth sign could have paid someone to do some type of spell work on you, all right? Um, but for some of you guys, whatever it was, it was meant to manipulate the energy, okay? So for a lot of you guys, this person definitely could have been doing spell work or pay someone to do some type of spell work and... For a lot of you guys, like I said, it was meant to manipulate the energy to stop you from leveling up like spiritually, okay? We have the manipulating energy. We have the doubt card. So for a lot of you, a lot of you guys, something about this person has been definitely doing some type of spell work. This person could have been attacking your crown chakra, okay? It's like somebody wanted you to be in some form of doubt. And I feel like whatever this spell work is, was um, that this person was doing to have you in doubt. It's something about you removing the self-doubt. This is somebody who wanted you to doubt yourself is what I'm picking up, okay? Because we have the they are a distraction. For a lot of you guys, this is someone who has been trying to distract you. We have the little note that flew out. It says releasing what no longer serves you to allow something new to happen. So if this is someone who wanted you to be in doubt or wanted you to be confused about releasing something. OK, this is someone who wanted you to feel like it was releasing something, a good idea or removing something. Was this a good idea? This is someone who wanted you to go back and forth in your head about releasing something. OK, they have been trying to distract you. And for a lot of you guys, like I said, someone has definitely been doing some type of spell work. All right. Someone has been trying to stop you from moving forward. OK, uh, but look, we have the energy vampire card. So this is someone who definitely could have been trying to energetically stop you from moving forward. Whatever it is that they have been trying to do, though, you have not been bothered by it, okay? And if they were doing some form of spell work, I feel like your ancestors, your angels, the Most High have been protecting you, okay? This is why someone's envious right now that all the spell work that they have been doing to try to block you from leveling up spiritually, it didn't work, okay? For a lot of you guys, we have the energy vampire and we have the karmic energies. So this could have been some form of karmic energy or energies, okay, is what I'm picking up. This could have been multiple people who have been energetically trying to block you, okay? We also have the little note that flew out. It says, also picked up trying energetically to drain you so you wouldn't go towards this big career change, okay? So it's something about you guys. This could be you. This could be people you work with, okay? Um, because for the for a lot of you guys, we had the big career change to fly on this note, okay? So this could have been karmic energies that you work around who have been trying to energetically stop you or block you from moving towards a new big uh, career, okay? For a lot of you guys, I'm picking up these people have been doing some type of moon magic, all right? And it was meant to try to slow you down or procrastinate you, all right? Something like you wouldn't be focused on whatever it is that you're working on. 
okay? It has something to do with your spiritual gifts, though, especially if you're a chosen individual, okay? Um, but look, we have the unstoppable card. Whatever it is that they have been trying to do, they couldn't stop you, all right? Look, we have calling back your power. So for a lot of you guys, whoever this is that's envious right now, that's giving you the evil eye, these energies, whoever they are, are mad because they could not stop you. It's something about you calling back your power. And we have, look, we have the authentic self. It's like somebody did not want you to know who you were, okay? It's something about you guys calling back your power, tapping back in to your authentic self, okay? Who you really are. All right. This is why I feel like this person has been trying to put so much distractions in your way. It's like these people did not want you to know. OK. Like I said, who you were. All right. So for a lot of you guys, I feel like you call back your power from these people. And I feel like whoever's watching you, they're upset right now because I feel like this is someone who have done so many things. Um, someone has put so many obstacles in your way. And it's something about you always overcome them. OK. You all always overcame all right, whatever obstacles that they put in front of you, okay? But we have the keep moving forward card that flew out here. And look, we have follow your dreams. So for a lot of you guys, it's something about you following your dreams or doing something that you're passionate about, okay? Someone knows that you're passionate about whatever this is, whatever it is that they're trying to have you stop working on or have you procrastinate on or have you not focus on. This is something that you're passionate about, okay? Okay? So I feel like your ancestors are wanting you to keep moving forward on whatever it is that you're doing, okay? For a lot of you guys. We have the follow your dreams. Look, we have the next level. A lot of you guys, you're about to reach this next level. Whatever this level that they have been trying to stop you from reaching, you guys are about to reach it, okay? Keep being your authentic self, okay? For a lot of you guys, you got some form of blessing. This next level is going to be a blessing for you, okay? We have the enlightenment also that flew out here, though, okay? You're going to get enlightenment around whoever this earth sign is. We have the untrustworthy. So for a lot of you guys, this earth sign could definitely be someone who you felt like you can trust. For a lot of you guys, you're going to get some form of truth or some form of light is going to be shed on who this earth sign is, okay? This person is not to be trusted. Okay, for a lot of you guys, that's what I'm picking up from these cards that flew out here. All right. So this is someone who I feel like a lot of you guys felt like you can trust, but this person's untrustworthy. We have look secretly doing spell work on you. So for a lot of you guys, this is someone who's been wearing a mask. This is someone who has been smiling in your face. But for a lot of you guys, this person has been doing spell work on you. I'm also picking up um, a queen of wands working with this earth sign. So this could be an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius working with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Okay. For a lot of you guys, these people are very untrustworthy. All right. These people have been doing spell work on you. Okay. And it's all the spell work was is meant or was meant to try to stop you from moving forward, okay? But it's not working, okay? A lot of you guys have called back your power from these people, okay? And you're going to, I feel like for a lot of you guys, you're going to release what no longer serves you, okay? It's like these people are trying to um, affect your decision making. It's like somebody's trying to make your decisions for you, all right? It's what I'm picking up with this spell work, all right? So um, some additional messages that came out for that spread is let's see all right we have the resistant change card so it's something like somebody wants you to resist some form of change okay this is the where the spell work was at all right for a lot of you guys i'm i'm also here that you are you are being tested to be your authentic self okay it's something about you releasing Okay, uh, we have water sign Cancer Scorpio Pisces. So you could be a water sign or this is a water sign involved. We have the smoky quartz. It helps with the grounding. So something about you guys ground yourself right now. Because for a lot of you guys, I'm picking up these people also have been doing spell work on your health. Okay. All right, for a lot of you guys, you're having pains right now. And for a lot of you guys, if you are a chosen individual, it's because someone's doing spell work. It's like they're trying to keep you stuck, okay? They don't want you to move forward. And they're trying to put in any obstacles so you're not moving forward, okay? Or, or trying to slow you down, okay? We also have the bloodstone crystal. It says it draws off negative energies, okay? So something about you guys work with the bloodstone crystal also, all right? It's going to draw off any negative energies around you. We have the fake account. Okay, so something significant about a fake account, 
if you are a chosen individual and you have some form of business online, a platform, I feel like whoever this person is could watch you from a fake account. Okay? It's what I'm picking up for a lot of guys with this card here. All right, something significant about a fake account. We have the bullying card. So for a lot of you guys, um, whoever this is also could have been putting you through some type of bullying. Or you could have went through some type of bullying. All right? Around whatever the situation is. We have the getting that business off the ground. So for a lot of you guys, it has something to do with you starting your own business. Okay? It's like somebody has been trying to block you from starting your business or getting your business off the ground. Okay? They have been putting a lot of obstacles for you. All right. Um, we also have the health card. So for a lot of you guys, this person has been trying to affect your health. I'm also hearing for some of you guys, whoever this person that has been doing spell work on you, a lot of you guys, you're going to see something go on with their health or this person could be having health issues. Okay. Because this is what someone has been trying to do towards you. All right. So I'm hearing like karma for some of you guys. This person could be dealing with health issues because this is what they sent out towards you. Okay, something significant about health. Okay, all right, so we're gonna pull some additional messages out here. Okay, and while I was doing y'all shuffling, the song that was playing was Deuces. Okay, so for a lot of you guys, also in the song is something about um, you, someone, the person leaving and moving on to something better. Okay, so it's like somebody does not want you to walk away from something. Okay, because they know something that you're walking towards is better than what you're in because you're releasing anything that no longer serves you. Okay, so for a lot of you guys, this was definitely the issue. Okay, it's like somebody does not want you to release something. All right, so let's see. Um, let's see if we can get y'all some additional messages here. Okay, if you are releasing a lot, please continue releasing. Okay. I feel like if a lot of you guys in divine timing, you're going to release whatever this is that someone is so in fear of you releasing. All right. All right. So we have angel of travel. Okay. So some of you guys could be traveling. Okay. Or something is significant about you traveling. Maybe you're going to release something so you can travel. Okay. We have angel of inner peace. Okay. Okay. So for a lot of you guys, I feel like whatever this is, once you release it, you're going to get so much peace, okay? A lot of inner peace from whatever it is that um, that you guys are releasing, okay? Look here. Angel of release, okay? You definitely are releasing something, okay? You guys are definitely releasing something, okay? And it's going to give you peace, all right? This could be anything. This could be a job. This could be a relationship is what I'm picking up for some of you guys. All right. Let's see if we can get one more. We have Angel of Harmony. Okay. It's going to, whatever it is that you release though, it's going to give you a lot of peace, a lot of harmony. Okay. But you definitely are releasing something. We have number 31. We have number seven. We have 27 out here. We have 24. Could be significant. All right. So we're going to pull out some. Um, let's see. And look, on the top of that other deck was that was flew over. It's Angel of Divine Timing. Something's definitely going to get released. Okay. In Divine Timing, I feel like a lot of you guys, you're going to release something. Okay. It's, it's, it's happening, all right? And I feel like this is somebody who has been trying their hardest. Look, we have I call back my power. Something about you calling back your power, all right, for a lot of you guys, okay? Someone did not expect you to call back your power or, or was able to regain your power back after all the things they have been doing, okay? Let's see with some zodiac signs that can relate here. We have fire sign Aries Leo Sag. So you can be a fire sign or this is a fire sign involved. We have Scorpio. We have the sun card. It flew out here twice, y'all. So this could definitely be a job situation. This could be people you work with that have been trying to block you from um, releasing something. Okay. And like I said, for some of you guys, you are being tested around, if, around releasing something. Okay. 
whatever it is that doesn't um, serve you. We have Pisces and we have Earth out here, okay? So this could definitely be an Earth sign or you could be an Earth sign. We have Leo, all right? So them could be your zodiac signs or these could be people involved. Um, but just know for a lot of you guys, like I said, something is definitely backfired on something, on someone, okay? I feel like a lot of you guys, you're going to release something. You're going to move towards something that makes you passionate, okay? It gives you some form of peace, all right? So that's what I have for you, Collective. Make sure you guys like and subscribe to my channel. I will speak with you guys in a minute, and I love y'all so much. Bye.